This is the Viseki Star Projector. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get a user manual, a remote control to control the device. It takes two AAA batteries, they're not included. USB cable for powering, it's USB to USB-C. And here is the star projector itself. It's just a round unit like that. This has a number of features to it. This is going to have LEDs in there that send color up to the ceiling. They move around in there. You can control that. There's also a laser star projector right there built in. And you have a bunch of features here. You have uh, the remote receiver right in the center there and a number of buttons for song forward, song back because yes, this can play music. Your power goes in there and there's a USB port where you can plug a flash drive in and it does have dual speakers on it. Another interesting thing, if you notice the switch, it says on, off, and Wi-Fi. And we'll get to that a bit later. But for now, let's just plug it in and we'll turn it on and uh, I'll show you uh, a few things it can do with the remote and we'll get into the Wi-Fi later. All right, we're plugged in. We'll put the switch to the on position. Bluetooth mode. And that's right. It said Bluetooth mode because you can also Bluetooth in with this from your device. I'll show you that now. See, it shows up right there under available devices. So I'll pair up with Bluetooth that, connection. and it says it's connected. So now it's playing through the speakers on here. I'll kick that up a bit. Volume maximize. It doesn't go ex exceptionally loud, but the sound quality is quite good from it. So now as far as the projector itself, Here's the remote, and you have a number of different features here. They have RGBW, red, green, blue, white. And what's interesting about that is you get to choose which LEDs you want on. Right now the blue is on. If you want that off, you hit the B, and it goes out. If you want red, you press R, and that goes. But if you leave the red on and turn on the blue, well, you get purple and you can add white to that and then you get that and uh, the green as well so you have options here as far as what colors you want to use another nice thing is the microphone button and now you can see that when I talk it'll flash in whatever mode it was if I tap it if you had loud music or something like that this would definitely flash with it uh, a lot nicer and that would be pretty nice. You can also just plug a flash drive in like that and it'll play your music just like that. I just want to give you an idea of what it will project. I will take this to another area where you can actually see it a lot better, but just to give you an idea. And then of course, like I said, you can adjust the colors in that as uh, I had shown before. And there's a lot of things that you can adjust as well. Right now I have the motor stopped but you can turn that on and increase the speed if you want or slow it down, stop it, anything like that. And there's a bunch of different things. There's fade modes where it'll change colors automatically. Bluetooth mode. Bluetooth connection. You can also adjust the brightness, turn it up or down. And there's a whole host of different things you can do with the remote here. There's also a timer. For one hour or two hours. So that's all fine and good and you can play with that all day long and uh, I'm sure you'd be perfectly happy with that but yet it does more. Earlier I had shown the power switch which also has a Wi-Fi mode so let's get that set up. So for the Wi-Fi what's really nice is that this uses the Smart Life app. If you currently have Wi-Fi outlets in your home or any other devices like that, especially ones where you can ask a smart speaker to control different devices in that, you likely already have this app, so you don't need an additional app to clog up your phone or tablet or whatever it is. 
So to set this up, we're going to put the switch to off, and then we're going to go Wi-Fi, off, Wi-Fi, off, Wi-Fi. Bluetooth mode. And then we're going to go to the app and set it up. So we'll hit the plus button. And we're going to go over to lighting and light source Wi-Fi. Now I'm going to connect to the right network. It now asks to make sure the light is blinking rapidly, so we'll confirm that and hit next. And now it's going to go and search and add the item. And it found it. We'll hit next. It wants a name. I'm going to call it, I think, Star Projector. So I'll change that name. So now the magic happens. Right now it's in white mode. We can turn the brightness down and it dims down. I'll set it brighter and it goes brighter. Set it way, way down like that. You can turn it off if you want and on and you can play with all of that. There's also a timer and a schedule timer was like on the remote where you have that one and two hour thing but now you have full control of however long you really want and the schedule works like one of those old school plug-in lamp timers that you have the dial on there to turn lamps on and off you can have it turn on at a particular time on a particular day and turn off at a particular time on a particular day so you also have the color mode right here and you see it has changed to red. Now I'll go and spin the color wheel around to green and around to blue and darker blue and into the purples and back to red. We get like an orange. So anywhere in there it'll show you. We had a nice color there. That's pretty nice right there. And you have your brightness once again that we can adjust. Turn that down and up and a contrast which makes it's really more like a color intensity kind of thing and there's also scene mode where you have different scenes here that it can automatically set depending on what you choose so there's all different things that you can do you can change colors and all kinds of great stuff like that. And within this mode, we can hit the edit button there and you can choose from different solid colors, add the flash mode and the flash speed. So you can run that up, for example, like that and hit submit. And now it changes color a lot faster and things like that. But yet, there's even more. Here is an Amazon Echo, a voice assistant or a smart speaker, whatever you want to call it. And yes, now you can control your star projector by your voice. Alexa, turn on the star projector. Okay. Alexa, set the star projector to green. Okay. Alexa, set the star projector to blue. Okay. And what's also nice is the book is very well written and tells you everything you need to know, including some of the voice commands that you can use with the star projector. So that's a really handy feature. And of course, you know, as before, it's Bluetooth. So if you wanted to link your smart speaker to it, that can be done. You'd have to go into this app and set it up through that and however the Bluetooth on this thing works. But yes, it is voice controllable as well. So now I'm going to take this into another location where it's dark so I can show you exactly what it does. I'm just going to be using the remote for that because it's going to be a lot easier for me to go through everything very quickly instead of having to ask, wait, it processes the command and it happens. So I can just press a button and it'll go. So this will give you an idea of what it does. 
you can do a couple of things here. You can turn that off and just have the stars if you want. And they sort of fade on and fade off like that. As you see. Or you can turn the stars off and just have the color. But we'll do both there. And like I showed before, you can add more colors to what you already have. So now we have blue and red. We can take away the blue and just have red. We can add green to that. You sort of get a red, green, yellow thing going on there. And switch to white. And the green is still on. So we can turn that off. And you can turn the stars off if you want with that as well. And just have that going on if that's what you wanted. But let's switch back to uh, maybe blue. I think that looks pretty good there. And as I showed before, you can change the speed. So that's going a lot faster. And we can slow it down and stop it even. Or just make it go slowly like that. So you have different speeds in there. You can change the brightness, as you see. So you can actually make it real dim like that, which is also kind of nice. The stars are always going to be this bright either way. The flickering that you're seeing on screen is not apparent in real life. You know, or you can brighten that up as such. And it also has fade modes. And here's another fade mode. And now if we go to the microphone mode, So it's got a lot of different things that it can do and produces some pretty cool patterns as well. So once again, this was the Viseki Star Projector. Very versatile all around, has a lot of features to it, can be controlled by an app and by a voice assistant. This has a lot of that technology in it there. So you can just have this do its thing whenever you want, just by your voice, or you can go into an app and play with that for hours on end. Or if you want to go old school, you still get a remote. All around, a great product. If you'd like to purchase this item, I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find the item available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.